Oh, here we go, I'm still at the high, high power AM broadcast site. Um, this funny looking thing at the bottom of the tower there, you can see the tower is, uh, is held off the ground. Um, it's over a copper plate but it's standing on quite a large uh, ceramic insulator there. But that, uh, that funny ring arrangement there is an AC coupling transformer uh, just for the mains. And what it does is uh, it allows the tower to be hot which this tower is. I mean, there's the uh, there's where the RF comes out. It's actually 70 kilowatts of unmodulated uh, power coming out of this. So the peak power is going to be four times that onto this tower. That's uh, that feed point there. I think I've shown you this one before, but uh, from in, I can't go in there when it's on. Obviously, it was off last time I filmed it. But you can see that the uh, the feeder goes across there and it goes onto that bracket. That's how the feed is connected to the tower. And um, the tower can be uh, the tower can be hot. And uh, those rings there are probably about two and a half feet in diameter, maybe a bit more. And that provides the uh, the AC coupling for the 240 volts for the uh, uh, for the lighting on the tower. The tower is uh, this tower's got uh, lights on it. And right up the top there, I've shown it to you before, but there's the there's the uh, there's the capacity hat about 600 feet up there. And I uh, can't see on this LCD display if that's in focus or not, but it actually appears to have a sort of petal structure. There are all sort of petals that are connected together. Now between the capacity hat and the mast is a tuned circuit. The capacity hat is not directly connected to the mast. And uh, the, uh, it sits on a big insulator and uh, there's, a, uh, there's a tuning circuit that uh, tunes the length of the mast to the uh, to the frequency they're uh, to, to the frequency they're interested in. So there we go. I think it's called an Austin transformer. That one, the uh, the light coupling transformer. <coughs> uh, as always, thanks for watching. Catch you next time.